on my way to my friend's pool party. She's having um, a birthday party. Okay, so I'm in Marshalls right now shopping for my friend's birthday. And there's this candle called Pineapple Pizza. It smells absolutely horrendous. Why did I smell it again? Disgusting. AZ might like this. And it's only $10. Okay, I'm not shopping for AZ. I had to put this candle back because it's too expensive for my budget today. So I'm not getting that one. I didn't know it was still coming on. I'm like, dang. Um, it was right over here. How much is this one? I was going based off color, if I'm being quite honest. And then it smelled good, but I knew. <sighs> it's citrusy, though, actually. It's not bad. It's just not me. Is it's actually kind of good, but it's like uh, up in the air. Ooh. Now that one's good. I'm not going to person. I'm not going to buy something for somebody that I wouldn't use myself, even if, like... Unless it's their taste, like unless you told me specifically. I love, you know, S and P. What is this called? It's pet odor. That's why it probably smells so citrusy. There's litter boxes out there. I just like candles. I'll do them up before I left you. Yeah. I think that's it. And we gotta get like little gift bags. So I got her the scalp massager. It's just like a whole bunch of stuff to just kind of throw into a bag because I really don't have much money to spend on this stuff right now. So um, a wet brush, but. This is actually not a good gift because she has locks, so we can't do that one. But it also could be a good gift, even though she has locks. I'm gonna get it and I'm gonna let her tell me if it's a good gift or not. And then I got these lip balms, the candle you just want me to pick up, and then this beauty headband, which I think is so adorable. If she wants, she could just take off the, um, I don't know, it's stuck on there. But I like it. I don't know. We're really girly in my friend group, so I think it'll work. But that's what I got her. Just something small that I could afford. I said within my budget, no matter who it is, mom, dad, and different. Why do I say indifferent? Like, as if that means what I think it means or mean it to me. I don't know. Um, alright, so now we need to get the bags. I wish I was in Dollar Tree, because I hate 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 buying gift bags i think i walked right into them how dope <gasps> that's cute boom um how much is it a dollar <gasps> what i like it i like things to match so i think i need a little bit more pink this one's two dollars So too big. Let me see. Which one? You know, but this is cute. I like this. I'm not gonna do this one. This is for my friend who is also Izzy's godmom, legitimately, even though I should not be spending, you know, even a little bit of money that I'm spending on this. I just got to, but she shows up so much for everything in life. How could I not, you know, show up for her? Let me turn this sideways, because that'll make it easier. But yeah, how could I not? So, yeah, that's it. This line is crazy. All right, so we finished that. I can't be the only one that just like people are literally on your ass in line. I'm like, bitch, back up. I gotta put on some hype energy to like get into the mood to want to be around my friends. They're lovely people. They are indeed, honestly. But I gotta get in the right energy. I don't want to come with blah. Mile, That's how I feel. Blah. Yeah. Hope you guys are having a good day. I had a really good chat with the cashier. She had purple hair and it was beautiful. I didn't get to tell her though. Because she was, um, like, you know how they call you up at Marshall's and they say, hey, like, number two, come to number three, next customer, number four, whatever. So she had number two. 
I saw the person leave her register and hide held my ass up there. I didn't wait for nobody to call me. So when I got up there, I also heard her manager talking about she can go to break after me. And I'm like, did I just fuck up your break? Because if so, um, I'm sorry. No, nah, like, we can, I can just wait. I'll go back. I was just trying to get away from the bitch right next to me in line. Like, you were real close. And I didn't like that. Boundaries were crossed. And I gave her a look dead in my face. Like, But she wasn't black, so she didn't understand that. She just smiled. And I was just like, ain't nobody smiling at you, sis. Like, it, it just wasn't happening. But anyway. On my way to the pool party. Also, I feel like I should not go or be in public. Matter red light, chill on me. I should not be in public when I'm on my period. The world does not need me when I'm on my period. They, I just need to be sitting somewhere, hiding somewhere, minding my business somewhere, not not out in public interaction. Because I be feeling like slapping bitches. And I felt like if she would have responded to me negatively, I would have hit her with my bag. And I'm like, what? what's wrong with you? And now in a sense, I'm going to just take it and throw it. But like, she was so close to me that if I would have just turned a little bit, I would have hit her. So I would have turned a lot of it. Jesus is working on me. He working on me. That, that's all I'm going to say about that one. He is working on your girl. Okay? Working. Because. Oof. I ain't been in this area since I used to live in this area. It brings back so many, like, horrible and great memories okay green light i used to be around all the time i had a little boyfriend that lived over here my family lives over here but i don't speak to them that's another story for another time i'm no storyteller i fish gold and yellow okay hi hey, how y'all doing <laughs> okay so i'm doing this I only got the voices, girl. You lucky. Didn't read any instructions, but I'm gonna guess you put a washer there, put a washer on the inside, and tighten it. Because she wants to make sure we don't judge it. <laughs> you guys, it feels tight. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, come on. <laughs> um, I feel like that's how you're supposed to do it. What? Yes. Put this part, I mean, it, let's just put alcohol on it. And like I said, if it drips, we gotta take turns just holding our mouth there and collecting the, the come on, it's like this, like, you know, just open it up. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Where'd you get these from? These are really cute. I was gonna go there this week with Izzy. Oh. So, I need you to fill it halfway with alcohol. But I have passion fruit and okay. watermelon. So, I'm ready. I'm making drinks and I'm the pothead. So, we're gonna see how this goes. <laughs> oh, also, guys, I'm making like little videos. So, if you think I'm talking to myself, yeah, it's just because. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> Regular. <laughs> And I'm guessing half of the Caribbean sunset and half of the OJ. You think you should do that more than halfway? With alcohol? Yeah, more than halfway with alcohol. Because I'm going to be drinking a She said make sure she gets lit and I'm respecting it. Okay, so I accidentally finished off camera pretty much, but we're gonna taste it and see if I'm really done. I feel like with the color, it already needs more orange, but you know, I'm not the liquor person. I'm the person that does the, or did the, so let's see. And I put this shit together, right? <laughs> we definitely could've used more liquor. I made that face cause I didn't know what to suspect. A little bit more orange. I feel like I was supposed to make a non-alcoholic one too, and I only have this left and this left. I might have to make a store run. Did um Mo just go to the store? Oh shit, Heritage is right there. 
Hi guys. This is what's happening apparently. Is that good? Because I feel like we about to use all the liquor in there. That's fine because I think Candy's grabbing something. <laughs> yeah. okay. Did not have to say it twice. Somebody will buy some more alcohol. The only reason I didn't buy anymore because I was like, I gotta drive home. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna pregame, like you already know, but I was like, oh wait, it's not enough time. Is he gonna be back with me? Okay. BRB. I think that's the which call it. Actually, pour the perfect amount. Oh, who wants a little bit of my shot? Yeah, I just want just a little bit. Cheers to Cynthia. Happy birthday. Oh, that's, so <laughs> that's so dope. You gotta film it. <laughs> okay, ready? Oh. Oh, please don't. Don't. Oh, my God. I'm ready. I'm oh. ready for you. I'm literally gonna jump in regular style. Go! Oh! I'm gonna do it too. It's like, nah, I'm not, I'm not gonna die. <laughs> you better not. I have your phone, so. It's not that deep. It's not that deep? Well, I mean, obviously. But you know how to swim, so I'm going to just stay over there. Yeah. Okay. How late are you? Oh I'm very God. late. This is crazy. Happy 21st! Oh, my God. All right. <laughs> You're not in love with this? It's Mitch Mac? Sorry, guys. Oh, oh you are. It's Mitch Mac. <laughs> we'll be back. But the bottom was a thong and it was too big, so it's kind of like, eh, we're here. Are she said, are you alcoholics? Let me know. There's nothing wrong with being an alcoholic. I mean, I hear you, bitches. I hear you. If you're not fucked up, then what are we doing? You want that? Keep your liver intact? Are you kidding me? 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 Girl, what the fuck? I'm gonna... thing about me, I'm going to save my life. Listen, <laughs> baby, apparently I I'm not, you know I'm not jumping. Uh, Shut up. You know I'm not jumping in. Hold up, hold up. Guys, 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 wait one second. Wait one second. No, y'all going to drown. I know. Y'all better not have burpees. I know. Are you sure? Yeah. Maybe we should spread them out. Let's spread them out. If, if y'all can't hold, if y'all can't swim... Just hold on to the. Uh, oh, I gotta say me. But who gonna say? Who gonna? Well, then who gonna say who? All right, you ready? All right. Okay, okay, okay. Cheers. 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 child's father but i mean regular regular schmegular you know because if i'm gonna be quite honest shorty got a little too lit but let's put everything in perspective i got to the gathering to the part to the party to the party to the party at legitimately 6 30 when i got there or by the time it was seven i asked hey what time are you ending you're in at nine o'clock right she was like no i'm ending at 10 i'm like oh shit i told him 9 30 that means i have to now tell him 10 30 he was upset about that. He's going through his own life things and yada, yada, yada. But I'm just like, bro, I am always with our child. I don't put him into care. I don't put him with a nanny unless I'm working, bro, unless I'm working. Other than that, Izzy, your shoe does not belong in the toilet. You need to get your teeth brushed. 
I don't see any of the five toothbrushes I bought you a week ago. I just don't. But your teeth may be brushed. I'm going to though, because I'm not about to send him to bed without his teeth brushed. Ah, uh, ah, uh, good job. Brush, brush, brush. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, we don't gotta fight. We don't have to fight. Look, look at me. Yeah. Your turn. It's so much fun. Oh, good job. Yeah. 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 You have to go potty? Let me take the of your potty. You have to go potty? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see if you have to go potty. You're dry, because daddy makes sure to change you. He puts your diaper on so darn tight. What do you think's gonna happen? You gonna fly away? All right, sit down. Oh, there you go. But yeah, that being said, it was just like, bro, like, I don't ask for much. And he's like, it's not about asking for much. Like, and as I'm looking at the whole thing in totality, I put these on because this top has a thong bottom and it was too big. I wanted to wear it. I was like, it had like a, a chain and everything too back there. It's giving 90s, early 2000 real. Ah, ah, toothbrush on teeth. Toothbrush on teeth. Good job, baby. Good job, baby. Ah, like this. Let me see. Let me see. Mommy wants to do it. <laughs> now I need to buy a new backup toothbrush because now I only have one and I know good and well I'll probably put my toothbrush in the toilet so but anyway what was I saying he's like it's not about that it's like about other things that I'm going through personally I totally get that but hear me and hear me clearly I have our, our beautiful child 24 7 I am not a partier not that I shame any parent that decides to do that I'm legitimately a homebody and that's cool I don't mind having my own child. I don't. I really do not. Like, the only time I do not have them is typically when I work. But that being said, it's like, bitch, give me a fucking break, bro. Yes, I had three glasses of wine, right? That, that's what I said. It's not the truth. Anyway, I had the equivalent of three shots. That, that's it. I am 100 and, like, fucking 12 pounds right now. That put me on my ass. And I had those shots at six. 30 when I got there, maybe 7 o'clock. So from 7 o'clock to 9.30, or actually from like 8 to 9, I was so lit that I'm like, y'all, I can't drive. I just, I cannot drive. I gotta give this some time to get through my system. Maybe I make myself throw up real quick. I don't know, I'll drink some water. I feel much better now. It's only 10, maybe 11 o'clock now, some 11 or something. I'm just saying. Burping. We just had a whole ass argument for no reason. Like, what did, what are we really fighting for? What are we really fighting for? I can answer that. I know why you were fighting with him. He wasn't fighting with you, girl. Okay, so now that I'm editing this video, it's green juice. It's the same green juice I always drink. I just put it in the um. Dunk. I was the problem yesterday when it came to that this particular situation. So I'm editing the video, and I'm looking back, and I'm like. Mm. First of all, he had no issue when I said 10.30 and I changed the time. He had absolutely no issue, okay? What happened was I got too late. 10.30 was still fine. I still made it. But I had called him and asked him a question. And he had told me no to my question. I'm not going to tell y'all what it was because that's just like too much information. It's not like, but still. Anyway, essentially he told me no. And he was also being really like, you know what I mean? Like, just think. So I'm like, why are you acting like that? Like, if you with the hoe, just tell me with the hoe. Like, we went together. Like, just so it kind of turned into that situation, okay? And it didn't have to. But again, one of us was intoxicated. That happened. Did I not put lotion on my feet? I would show you guys this, but you might try to like pour lotion on your phone in hopes that my feet become less ashy. What the hell is going on? Um, but yeah. Anyway so that happens the biggest issue was that he had told me no and the way he was speaking was very aggressive and i didn't like that because i'm a princess so like i don't know what kind of what kind of stuff you're doing and who you're talking to but you're not talking to me kindly and i'm a little belligerent so i was like don't come to my house in 10 45 he got there at 10 43 i said two minutes he knocked i said two minutes he didn't respect that he finally walked away because I was like, I did warn you via text that I'm going to curse you out if you come here, you know, earlier than 1045. Because I just needed like three seconds to breathe, bro. Just at one point, he was just like, you know, talking to me. I was talking to him. And this is why you should never trust anybody that has baby daddy. You should not. 
and you should not because personally <laughs> don't trust me with my baby daddy don't and don't trust him with me just if you think you're dating him okay if you think you're dating me okay that's all i'm gonna say about that that's all i'm gonna say about that he wasn't really the problem i was so let me continue to take accountability i had to call him and apologize if i read the text messages i sent him i was like damn okay misspelling i was misspelling everything but yeah okay back back to the program for real be fucking for real what are we really fighting for absolutely nothing so i'm just like it ain't that deep i'm not shading you but after i had that conversation i thought like hold up maybe you need to be the parent that's dropping off at 9 a.m at 8 a.m maybe for your sanity a couple times a week besides friday the rest of the week. where's your diaper Why do you have your nightgown pants on? No, but it's just...